that player in space facing Elijah Mitchell, who you know is a guy that has good size, ran four four nine, and while he may not be truly a hundred percent back off of uh, you know a, a injury that cost him much the season, he's got fresh legs, as they say, and I could see at least one big play coming from him. I could see Purdy making at least one big play with his own legs. He's a better athlete than people realize. He may not look super athletic. He may not have an athletic profile when you look at his testing numbers that blows your mind, but he's tough and competitive, and I would compare him in terms of athletic profile to even a guy like, say, uh, Baker Mayfield, right? Uh, picks up yards that you wouldn't think he would pick up, runs tougher than you think he would, and, of course, can make big plays outside the pocket with his arm as well. We all know about Mahomes and what he does outside the pocket, but watch out for Purdy to make, if he makes, I'd say, three big plays outside the pocket deep down the field, that spells a 49ers victory. I think that, ironically, it would behoove the Chiefs to take the air out of the ball a little bit to try to put together some four, five, six-minute drives and to possess the ball. Look for them to try to work the ball to the other tight end, Noah Gray. And then last but not least, the other thing that I'm sort of focusing on is how that Chiefs secondary, which is very, very good, holds up against those potential deep shots and obviously George Kittle working the middle versus the reverse, uh, the 49ers secondary, which is a little less uh, celebrated, still good, but less celebrated, holding up against obviously not just Kelsey, but Rasheed Rice. And then, like I said, I've put my circle around Justin Watson. I think if Justin Watson has a big game, that spells victory for the Chiefs. But I'm seeing this as about a 20... like 24-27, somewhere in there for, for the Chiefs. And once again, uh, I'll, just like you, I'll be watching this with rapt attention. Uh, once again, and I'll, I'll hop on again at uh, halftime and, and do a quick sort of looking back at what we've seen and looking forward to what we will see. But I'll, I'll have that up when we get to halftime once again. Bill Carroll, Zitney 60 Media. I'll be watching, and so will you. <laughs> 